And we are going to start off business news by talking about the dollar because it is hitting a seven week high. Haley Wynn with Business in Vancouver is joining us now with more. And as you saw there, Haley, the dollar is up again this morning. Uh, what's behind this rise? We've seen a boost in oil prices this week, which always tends to help the Canadian dollar. But yesterday in particular, we also saw some optimism around NAFTA. The U.S. and Mexico are entering what they're calling rapid fire or rapid track talks between the two countries. These discussions don't include Canada. Both countries will be meeting for a second one-on-one -on -one meeting this week. And the U.S. has said they're fairly close to reaching a deal with Mexico. Of course, the pressure or the timeline there is that Mexico has an outgoing president and the U.S. has about until the end of August to reach a deal with Peña Nieto before the new president comes online. But Canada waiting on the sidelines at this point. Our foreign affairs minister has said she's ready and willing to fly to Washington when the time is right. But Canada left out of these talks for the time being. All right. And you also have some news for us regarding WestJet today. That's right, WestJet posted their second quarter earnings and there's about a $21 million loss that's down 140% year over year when the company saw about $50 million in profit. Now, two big challenges facing the company in the second quarter. One was a potential pilot strike that was averted and the other was higher fuel costs. This is something all airlines are dealing with and WestJet says fuel expenses year over year up 34%. Now, it's not all bad. Revenue up 3%. Passenger miles traveled up 6%. The company says they're disappointed, but optimistic, partic optimistic particularly when they consider that Swoop is now an option for travelers mm -hmm. and they also have other services like WestJet Link. All right. Haley Wooden with Business in Vancouver joining us on this Tuesday. Haley, thanks so much. Thank you.